athlete. It was the, the family friendly, and it wasn't that friendly at one point, but a great result for us. Yeah, yeah just competitive for fault. You know, I just wish the referee I, I could have had some common sense and asked us to take both lads off rather than send them both off because they miss games now. And look, I, I don't know if it's a referee's fault. I think they're told now by the FA that they have to put their sending offs through, but. It wasn't a dirty game, it was a competitive game and that's what we wanted out of this. We both wanted that today and I thought it was a really good game and um, just a shame at the end there it didn't have to happen like that but that's football and uh, we have to move on from it. One goal decided it, it came early from Isaac Galliford, it was an absolute beauty. Yeah, it was a really good goal and Isaac's got that in him, he knows Trent brilliantly this week and um, the one thing he's got is them little bits of quality that can win your games of football and that's why I brought him to the club, that's what he does and I was really pleased with that so it was a great goal to win the game but I said to you before and you know it, was, uh, it doesn't mean something to win games, of course it does but it, I'm just really pleased with the levels that we got to today, I think we can be better in possession uh, but I thought we played against a really good centre open side, I thought, I thought they were really good to be fair at times and um, we defended as a group and as a unit and um, to keep clean sheet against them was, was a real positive. It's not often we're going to play against a team a level up and beat them and, and you're right, I thought it was an all round really solid performance. So two more friendlies to go before the season starts properly. Thoughts? We've just said from day one about standards and, and I thought we dropped below our standards on Tuesday night and, and I told them and I thought today we've probably gone above our standards. So we need to get that level ground and, and make sure that we keep at it and keep at it and we've set a, a standard today that I want us to try and reach as much as we can. We're not always going to get there, that's football, um, but I thought as a whole, as a unit, it was really good. And I expect the same Tuesday and next Saturday. We've got two really hard games coming up. We are a little bit walking wounded. You know, we had some big players missing today. But I thought the boys have come in done really well. We look solid. And um, we must take it forward to, to Tuesday and then Saturday and prepare for what I think is going to be a really good game side in two weeks' time. So tonight you're going to go home, uh, chat with your dad, chat not with your dad, uh, is it, um, how's he going to take this job? Uh, now listen, he's building for, for what he's done at St Albans, no one would realise what a good job he's done at that football club, that football club was in dire straits when he took over there, what he's done there is, is unbelievable, it's a professional club on and off the pitch now that he's brought to that football club, he's got a brilliant side, he's the best manager I've ever seen him work with, uh, and I would say that, but you ask players that he's had before and, and has now how good he is, and uh, they're very lucky to have him so from my point of view it's just one of them things he beat me last year he battered me last year and we talk fine and we'll talk fine today because we all want the same out of this you know we want to do well we want good sides and I think he's got a really good side there and he won't determine today on his team on the result he's got minutes into his players what he needs I think we've seen there at times they've, they've really put us under the cosh got a great forward line so you know they'll, they'll be just fine and um, they're a good side and they'll be up there so I'll be telling them that in a minute over a beer and I'll tell them again later when, when we speak tonight.